Hey guys, I'm here to explain how the quantum algorithm works and how to get access in this technology. First of all, a quantum algorithm is a set of computer instructions to analyze problems that are not based on calculations, but instead uses the unique nature of quantum reality, whereas a single bit of data can represent two opposite values, such as a zero in the logic binary. Before we get further into the algorithm, it is important to know where quantum computers came from and their concept. The concept of quantum computers was first proposed by Richard Feynman in 1982 to simulate the complex physical systems. Although the rapid development of classical computers enables theoretical physicists to numerically study and calculate the basic properties of various states of matter, Recently, the technology of quantum computing hardware achieved rapid breakdowns. A good example of algorithm is your own computer. It can be called a classic computer. The type of computer uses electronic components to represent bits. The bits are the smallest units of information existing. A bit has only two values, 0 or 1, and all that happens in the background of your computer. Quantum computers use vastly different systems and each has a different utility in the same way. Current computers also use small pieces of information but instead of bits we have qubits. They use the superposition to their advantage. Each quantum algorithm has its own functional for the superposition. For example, Grover's algorithm uses the interference to locate information among thousands in a short time compared to the classic computer. Quantum computers are extremely difficult to handle, but this difficult is overcome daily by scientists, whose applications benefits, cryptography and security, medicine, computation physics, and step-by-step -step advance the knowledge of mankind. And quantum computers has a lot of benefits, like you can see now. So, how we get access in this technology? Huge companies nowadays, like IBM, Google, Microsoft, and Amazon, are on pace to develop cloud quantum computers. They combine quantum computers with cloud computing that can be accessed by a network without having it. It means, soon enough, people as a basic user will have the opportunity to test the power of quantum computers in a cloud computing. These companies will give us the opportunity to have access to a technology that is in the distant future of being consumed by us in your daily lives. Over the years, the dream of having a quantum technology in hand is getting closer. With the creations and recent discoveries, it looks like Google has given us the first experimental evidence that quantum speedup is achievable in a real-world system. Company have different performance and specification and limits, like Microsoft with Azure and Quantum, IBM with IBM Mid, Google with his Quantum Supremacy, and Amazon with Amazon Bracket. So, with these advances of technology, many people will be enabled to use those technologies to the difficult in the learning curve and will affect the learning rate of people learning quantum computing, making it rather problematic for the newcomers in cloud computing. Over the years, we will experience more and more of this technology that is becoming very important for the evolution of humanity as a whole. With all these algorithms being created and research being done, it is a matter of time for quantum computing to be present and encouraged to all. And gradual is being encouraged by governments and does having a great reach. Thanks to you all for watching. Leave your feedback in the comments. I will leave the reference and the data that I use. Thanks guys.